Hello folks and welcome to another Adventures of Scott and Michelle. Today's Adventures takes you to Bob Evans in, um, in Madison, Indiana. So join us on another one of our adventures. they even have a sign that says welcome to Bob Evans please wear a face face covering as required by the state yeah, you got to wear face covering there cowboy so let's go inside folks and see what they have to offer so let's see what they have here in the menu they got fresh farm let's see farm fresh combos they got farmers choice double meat farmers choice homestead farmers choice Ooh, banana berry farm. Mm. I also like one called the whole hog farther down. Oh. Whole bunch of pork. Oh yeah. Oh, that sounds good. Ooh, they have the three egg omelet and skillet. So honey, have you decided what you wanted? Um, not quite. Oh, I might do the sirloin steak and, and eggs, which is the steak with two eggs, and I guess it comes with either two biscuits or banana nut bread. Okay. But I'm still looking to see what else there is. Okay, sounds good. Okay, so my husband's going to get the three meat and cheese omelet. It's loaded with hickory smoked ham, hardwood smoked bacon, farm fresh sausage, American cheese, provolone cheese, uh, caramelized, onion, onions. caramelized onions, and diced tomatoes. And finished with cheddar cheese served with two freshly baked biscuits or banana nut bread. That does sound really, really good. Yeah, I'll probably take the biscuits, even though I may not eat them all or I might share with you. And then yeah. it also comes with another choice of either hash browns, home fries, or fruit or grits. So I'll, I think I'll take fruit. Yeah, I probably will do fruit. So I think I'm going to go with uh, um, breakfast meat. I think I might go with the bre I mean, breakfast value. It's two eggs cooked to order, served with your choice of breakfast meat and two freshly baked biscuits or banana nut bread. I think I might just get the two eggs um, and then I might either get sausage and uh, fruit instead of the biscuits and the banana. So, I, yeah, I think I'm gonna go with fruit. Now they have this thing on here called the whole hog. It's got two strips of center cut hardwood smoked bacon, two sausage, patties, two sausage slings, one slice of hickory smoked ham, two fresh cracked eggs cooked to order, one buttermilk hot cake, and one slice of thick cut roshi French toast. Now I would be able to eat that, but man, that is a lot of food. So I think I might just stick with my breakfast value that I'm thinking of getting. Mm -hmm. But if I did get this, I would have to skip the French toast and skip the hot cakes. Oh, I miss my French toast. Mm -hmm. Hey, honey. Hello. What was she saying about green or something? Okay, so there they ran out of milk. So to get the milk here, you have to go outside and milk a cow. That's what they require now here at Bob Evans. <laughs> you fine. Uh, no, I'm sorry. Okay, so she said French vanilla or um, regular milk. Regular. Okay. Wow, that looks really good, hon. Yeah, I already ate some of it because I was starving. Um, yeah, yeah, you can see there's sausage, bacon, tomatoes, onions, some ham, cheese, egg, 
but it's all it's all good. And um, plus they gave us um, some biscuits. We're gonna split the biscuits, or you know. Yes. We're, we still try to avoid carbs as much as we can. Got some nice regular coffee and, and some nice fruit. Yeah. Oh, and I see you got some sugar-free syrup too. Yep. That's awesome. Mm -hmm. Well, this is my plate. I got eggs, sausage, and bacon, and this looks really good. And I also got some fruit on the side. Wash it down with my uh, diet Pepsi, but yeah, this is really, really good. So, how's your breakfast, Sydney? Oh, it's really good. I like the eggs. Oh yeah, eggs are quite good. The uh, omelet was that I had was wonderful. A lot of meats and stuff. Mm -hmm. Did you get your bacon? Yes, I did, and my bacon was rather good. Okay. I must have forgot, honey. I gave you a slice. <laughs> yeah, you're right. Well, sometimes I don't know where my mind goes. Yeah, don't get old, folks, please. <laughs> Wow, our meals were so good. We like clean plate. Mm -hmm. So it was rather good. Well, let's take a look at our bill. Let's see what we have here. See, the coffee was $2.59. The three meat and cheese omelet was $9.99. That's not that bad. Uh, my Diet Pepsi was $2.59. Uh, my classic breakfast was $6.99. Then I got a side of bacon, which was $3.49, so that's not too bad. So, let's see. Subtotal was $25.65, plus $1.79 for tax. So, total wound up being only $27.44, so that's pretty not bad for breakfast. That was pretty reasonable. And I am stuffed. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm sure it's full too. Yeah. Well, folks, that's going to conclude it for our vlog uh, and review of the Bob Evans restaurant. So, what did you think, hon? Uh, the food was great. The service was excellent. Uh, the only thing that was a little bad is uh, the silverware. They do have a lot of water spots on, on them. I guess it's made because yeah. it's hard water. But then it's like the first fork I had had a little egg in it. So, I had to ask for... Um, for a clean fork and they did uh, you know provide that for me the service was good and what was really nice I thought it was an added touch so the waitress said oh can't would you like to have an extra uh, uh, extra coffee and uh, yeah so extra coffee and I drink. got my uh, diet uh, Pepsi to go and, uh, and Scott got also decaf got him coffee. yeah he got some decaf decaf coffee to go so the service was excellent, um, everything was really good, the food was great. Um, I actually miss Bob Evans. They used to have Bob Evans back by us. I don't know if there is any Bob Evans back by us. I mean, I there haven't seen be. any. There's I, still one, I think, maybe in Plainfield and maybe like in Joliet, somewhere down yeah, there. Yeah, but we're not 100% sure because it's been a while since we've been up that way. But yeah, Bob Evans, I, I miss Bob Evans. Yeah, it's uh, decent food, de decent price, uh, and you know it was a nice, it was a nice, you know, nice place to go. Um, and um, you know we like going to different restaurants when we go to different towns and stuff. And um, you know after this, well, right next to the Bob Evans, there's a J.C. Penney and a Gordman store that are going out of business. So we'll go, we'll check out those clearance. Yeah, so uh, we're gonna go and sales. take a look and check them out. Uh, but remember, Bob Evans down, down on, on the, the farm. farm. Thanks for watching, folks. Thanks. And if you haven't subscribed, please hit that subscribe button so you don't miss any more upcoming adventures of Scott and Michelle. And we really want to appreciate you guys and thank you for watching. Thanks. Stay safe out there, folks. Love you guys. Yep.